hello everyone and welcome back to my channel today i am in my office i'm at work today isn't this nice this is so nice you guys you know when your your boss says we'll find you a place you wind up in the closet that's where your office is you see this look Oh, mm-hmm. This is this is where my desk is, you guys. This is where I work. It's a lovely office out there. But yeah, I'm in the closet. I feel a little like Milton from Office Space. This is my swing line. So anyway, to need like a midday cup I'm just having a rough day pick myself up today at lunchtime I wanted to run over to a Michaels that's near here um, most of my Michaels haven't had any of those four dollar grab bags so I was like eh, I'll just go check it out and see if they have any not thinking that they would they did they had so many grab bags I was so excited um, I noticed most of them were like floral picks from Christmas which I wasn't like too into, but I grabbed whatever I could and I have not opened any of them yet. So I'm going to open them with you guys, um, with this beautiful backdrop that I have. Um, thank you all for coming back and visiting my channel. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and like and comment and let's get into these grab bags i am so excited to see what i got you guys like i have no idea what's in here i only grabbed four at first and then i was walking through the store and i was like i gotta get two more for four dollars you never know what you're gonna get inside so i spent um i got six bags that's at four dollars that's twenty four dollars plus tax so i spent twenty five dollars total and let's see what i got for twenty five dollars so here's my first bag. Now I'm very jealous of everyone who gets like these Michaels boxes for $4, like full of stuff. Mm -mm. Girls, they are stingy at our Michaels. We get these little bags full of stuff. So I mean, it's a grab bag, but I am definitely jealous of everyone who's got these big boxes, like full of stuff for $4. So. Let's see what we get for four dollars. Get scissors. Okay, you know what? I'm never gonna get it back in. Yes. Ooh. So much glitter. So much. Ooh. Ooh. I'm already regretting opening this bag. All right. Let's see. What's the first item? All right. Well, here's a pick. Mm -hmm. It's not really my style. I think, I mean, no, I'm not going to use that. Let's hope there's something better in there. That's in it. Garbage. But thank you, thank you, Michaels, for attempting to put something in here. All right. Well, I got a pile of glitter. Hold on. Ooh. All right. What did I get here? Two holiday DIY gifts it says but these look like they're green see these these look like either like a napkin i don't know if you're supposed to use it for fabric like a hand towel kind of reminds me of that um but those are nice you could definitely do something with these some iron-ons do something cute i don't know use it use the fabric i don't just says holiday DIY gift, so I guess you're supposed to DIY it. But yeah, so two of those. What is this? Oh, well, it looks a little sad, but I think it's got potential. I could do something with this for next year. It's kind of cute. Spruce it up, add a couple more picks to it. Um, it's definitely like got a wintry vibe. Maybe like I paint this. But yeah, that's cute. That was seven dollars originally. Who's paying seven dollars for this? Come on now. How much were these? Let's see. Six, six hundred and 
six dollars each. Six dollars for this. Oh. Now what's this? one more thing in this bag? Let's see. Oh, how cute is this? <gasps> Ooh, I love this. Look how cute. I have like all like silver and dark and glass and kind of like a retro feel in my house. This is very cool, you guys. This um, tabletop decor retailed for thirty dollars. My gosh, thirty dollars? That's crazy. All right. Well, I feel like if just this was in the bag for four bucks, that was pretty good. So, got that. Let's. Ooh. Ooh. I gotta. All that glitter. All right. On to the second bag. Let's see what we got. Ooh. I don't know if something's broken inside or it's like a lot of little pieces. Let's see. All right. So here is, oh, that's kind of cute. It's a little like wood plaque. It says, baby, it's cold outside, snow angels, oh, what fun, dashing through the snow, yada, yada, yada. Um, this retailed for $18. This is very cute. I would, I would keep this and use that. I like that. All right, some tapered candles, unscented, originally $7. So I can do something with these for the holidays or uh, d fancy dinner party. Get out my candelabras and put these in there. Um, but yeah, candles are always good to have. Oh, cute. There's a little ornament and it's a little piece of cake. How cute is that? That's very cute. Is it all there? Yeah, it's a little like crunched up. It's still kind of cute. And this one retailed for $12. I mean, it's it's like squishy. Oh, it's kind of squishy. Ooh, I would not pay $12 for that. But, oh, my daughter is going to love this. Oh, my gosh. So all the rest of this bag is cookie cutters. And we love using cookie cutters year-round. I cut out her sandwiches. Um, with like cute little shapes depending on the you know holiday or season and she uses them with our play-doh and then of course when we bake cookies you know she uses them then so there's a little gingerbread man and these retailed for two dollars each here's a little uh, reindeer head it's very cute Another ginger man, gingerbread man, another reindeer. Oh, this is a little like Christmas light. A little snowflake. Another Christmas light. But these will be like really good. This is like duplicates. So like these would be really cute with like a little baking gift for next Christmas. So yeah, I could definitely use these. Another reindeer. Looks like I got three of those. Oh, four of those. Reindeer heads were not popular this year at Michael's. What else? Oh, and actually, I bought a couple of these when they went on clearance. And I don't know if I have these or not. But these are so cool. So there's this one, which is like a bigger size. And this one's a snowman. And it's got the little, like, punch. And it's got the stamper. So not only does it cut, but it imprints... Well, it's not gonna let me because it's thicker. It imprints this image on the top of like the cookie. So these are really cute when you're. I mean, these are even really great for Play-Doh. I bought a bunch of the small ones, which here are some small ones that I just got. Um, and these are snowflakes. And I bought these for my daughter for her Play-Doh because I thought these would be really cute to punch out and stamp. So yeah, that's very cute. All right, bag number three. I hope my phone doesn't ring. People are expecting me to work up in here. Mm -mm. All right. Ooh. All right. So I got, let's see, eat, cheer, Christmas. The spirit of giving adds joy to the season and gladness to living. So a pack of 16 cards and envelopes. These retailed for $15.
Oh boy. Here's another one. Oh, this one's cute. I don't think I got her this one. This is the little um, snowman, the mini version. These retailed for $2 as well. It's interesting to me that these these stamper ones retailed for the same price as the metal ones, but I feel like these do more. Oh. All right. Oh, cute. All right. So this was originally seven dollars. This is by Art Minds, and this is. Oh, maybe it's supposed to be make your own shatterproof water globe. How cool is that? My daughter is going to love this as a craft. That is very cool. And again, this retailed for seven dollars. I never actually even saw these at Michael's, but I probably wasn't looking because there's so much stuff at Christmas. Um, yeah, very, very cool. I'm very excited about this one. All right, so you take off the lid and it's got like, ooh, clearly like a waterproof seal. Yeah, so it's got this like little stopper that you put in here and that's obviously gonna keep the water from leaking out and then this goes on top and screws on. And then, you have your little snow globe. Very cool. I love that. What else? Okay, table <laughs> tabletop game of bowling. Bowling? Yes, bowling. Originally five dollars. All right. Well, my daughter will get a kick out of that. It's a little tiny. Oh, so many cookie cutters. Oh, this one's cute. This is a sweater cookie cutter. They clearly had an abundance of cookie cutters left. Here's a glove. I'm like almost upset that I even got some of this stuff. Like, I don't think I got this one, but I definitely bought like the snowman ones um, when they were all like 80 or 90% off. But anyway, there's a glove or a little mitten. This one's cute. This is a little, another one with a little press as well. And this is a little ornament. Oh, this one's so tiny. This is a little ornament as well. And these all retail for $2. Yeah, even the big ones retail for $2. So, hmm. I don't know. Does that look like it should be equal in price? I don't know. Maybe. Hmm. Whatever. Oh, hmm. just so many more of these. All right, let's see how many more are in here. I don't think there's any new ones that we haven't seen. No, we've seen all these. All right, so everyone's getting uh, cookie cutters next Christmas. Get ready. And what are these? These are so cute. What is this? All right. It's just envelopes. But that's kind of cool. You could do something with this, like letters to Santa or something cool. These are a pack of 50. Oh, my gosh. 50 envelopes and they are so big they are the craft paper with like this um like little red striping on the on a, as a border so you get 50 of those that's a lot of, a lot of envelopes i hope we can find something to put in there but this might be cute for for something and they're very big does it say what size six by nine these might be cute for a little like um cute little mail happy mail and stuff so smiley mail what do we call it whatever bag number four this stuff is piling up all right please no more cookie cutters Ugh. okay another piece of cake Oh, that's kind of cute. You could personalize this. All right, so this is a um, an ornament, and it's a little um, like cupcake. And right here, you would be able to like write like the child's name or something on here. So that's very cute. This would be make like really cute to go with like a gift or on a gift box. Oh, how cute! Okay, so this goes with the other silver one. I love this. I actually would probably take the ribbon off and use this. Um, you know, with that on the table. And this is, this is retailed for $10. And it looks like, well, it's supposed to be an ornament though. Hmm. It's got this hole in the bottom. I'm wondering if you could put like a tea light under it or one of those like 
um, battery operated ones. I don't know. But anyway, very cute. Oh, how cute is this? No one has an E name in my immediate family, but I do know who this could go to. So this is supposedly, all right, so it doesn't have batteries. This is a little E ornament and it's got lights on it and you just turn it on with like the little battery pack and it lights up. How cute, and it's actually like pretty heavy. So if you, oh, it's got, how cute you guys. Like you could take the ribbon off and it's got the little like hanger for the wall. So you could totally put this in like a little girl's room or something. That's very cute and I know exactly who will get this. All right, we got another barn. Oh my goodness, look how tiny. Uh, all right, this goes with the set, I guess. This was $10, this ornament. Oh my gosh. But it's a little windmill. That's cute. I guess it goes with the set. You know, you have your little town you put together. Ugh. You guys. All right, well, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve. There's twelve more cookie cutters in this bag. But this is cute. So, a whole spool of this ribbon. So, I like that. That is very cute. I will definitely use that on gifts. And what else is here? This looks like, oh, oh my goodness. So not only did they like give me all those loose cookie cutters, there is this cookie cutter set, which actually this would be cute to gift um, because it's like the whole set and they're all shaped like little penguins. So that's very cute. You'd put that with like a little baking set for somebody. But yeah, everybody I know is getting cookie cutters. Do you want a cookie cutter? I'll send you a cookie cutter. I only have 500 of them. Alright, let me put all of these. I'm going to put these all in the bag. Alright, let me put all I do really like the press ones though. Those are really great for my daughter, but I definitely don't need, you know, six of each. Maybe we'll do a giveaway. Hmm? All right, bag number five. Oh, who's calling me? I got business, but shh. All right, back to the bags. Bag number five. Oh, where's my scissors? All right, maybe I can actually open this one without the scissors. Oh, I'm breaking now. All right. Ooh, I'm actually really excited about these, you guys. I wanted these. I was actually gonna buy these. Um, yes. Okay, so these are the uh, stocking hangers and they're silver with the bells and you get four of them, which is so great. I actually only thought that they came two in a pack, so this really excites me. So. Yeah, this is great. And I think they might have sold these in gold, too. I'm not really sure. But I remember seeing these, and I wanted to get them, and I didn't. So, that makes me happy. All right. What is this? Dove replacement bulb sets. Oh, all right. For the Christmas tree I don't have. This is... These are the little... I don't know if you can see them. They look like little doves okay and these are supposed to go in the um those ceramic christmas trees they were like old school like i had one when i was a kid my parents had one and i love them and they came out with them again like over the years and maybe they were really pushing them this year um but normally they come with just like a regular bulb on them and these must be the little doves so these are great if i ever get a ceramic christmas tree Oh, more cake. Mm. 
Does anyone want a cake ornament? Comment down below. All right. Let's see. Here's another one of the ornaments. And these, again, were $10 each. So now I have like a whole little town. Whole little town. Oh, this is cute. I love like retro y looking stuff. This is cute. It's just like you could even put like a little gift card in this or something. This is like a little hot cocoa tin. And, and it comes off. And it's like, it's pretty good size. And this retail for $12. But yeah, this is cute. Looks like a little thermos. I'm going to put some of this stuff back in here. It's getting deep. It's getting deep. Oh, I don't even want to ruin that. That E is so cute. All right. All right, last and final bag. You guys, if there's more cookie cutters in here. $25 worth of cookie cutters. All right. You never know what you're going to get. All right. Let's see. First up, another tabletop game. Here's the soccer one. So now I have bowling and soccer. All right. Ooh, these are cute. I always do tons of crafts with my daughter, and we always have, like, Christmas parties or, um, you know, uh, like winter parties where all of our friends kids come over so these are going to be great these are these were originally eight dollars and these are the foam um, shapes and you get 30 of them and a little snowman and these are by Creatology. so these are very cute oh i love these look how cute these were uh, originally retailed for $5, and these are pocket envelopes. How stinking cute are these? Oh, I love those. So cute. All right, this, this bag's pretty good. Oh, my goodness. 50 more envelopes, you guys. <laughs> All right, so these are just red envelopes, and, yeah, retailed for $10. We have a lot of envelopes for next year. Oh my God. Look. Alright. Mm -mm. Oh, cute. Okay. So these are little puffy stickers. And all this year's popular characters. You have the sloth. The unicorn, cactus, llama, a little cactus, and a flamingo. So, and you get two sheets of that. So those are very cute. All right, guys. Well, that's it for the haul. So that was twenty-five dollars worth of stuff. But there was definitely some good stuff in there. I'm actually pretty happy about it because I probably would have spent close to that or more um, just on the couple items that I really, really like. Um, I wasn't planning on doing it, but let's do a giveaway so clearly I have enough cookie cutters so if you would like some cookie cutters comment down below and I'll pick I'll pick three people three people um, to give cookie cutters to what else hold that thought okay I'm back all right, so what else can I give away? We got three people for cookie cutters. You know what? I'm going to pick three additional people for a surprise. So comment down below if you want cookie cutters specifically. Comment down below. If not, you just want to enter. You have to be in the United States or Canada to qualify for this giveaway. So that is a total of six people getting giveaways um, for this video. So comment down below what 
your favorite item was from the haul. That doesn't mean that's what you're getting in the giveaway. But comment down below what your favorite item was from this haul. And if you want cookie cutters, mention that. And I think that's it. I have to get back to work, you guys. This is a very important job that I have here, as you can tell by the beautiful office that I was given. So I need to get back to work. You guys get back to work or do whatever it is you're doing. Um, I know y'all are like at work and you're like see really watching these videos. But all right. So enter the giveaway. U.S. Canada only. Thank you so much for watching my videos. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Like and comment. Hit that bell notification so you know when all of my new videos are uploaded. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.